Boom. Welcome to the RTM Podcast Show. You already know episode five. Big Bad Spray, Young Spray, <laughs> whatever you want to call me. Yeah. So um, today I'm with my co-host, Queen Ice Cream. You already know. That's good, everyone. And I've got my special guest today, Lady Fury. Oh, well. Hey, hey, hey. What's um, happening? Old school female Graham MC, um, one of the originals, to be fair. And um, obviously, we've got her in today. Um, I'm going to do a run a quick interview on her quickly because um, everyone was getting on to me about, yeah, I need to sharpen up on my hosting skills and they need to know about the guest. Um, so, yeah, um, tell them about yourself, your music journey. Okay. When did you start doing music? I got into the game when I was 16. Um, always been into music from young, like mm. my brother, the influence of my parents, mm -hmm. and then Garage and Jungle was about. Mm -hmm. like my uncle, What's your ethnicity? My mum's actually South African. Uh, my mm. dad's Dominican. Okay. But, um, but, but, but. Yeah, that, that's, that's the, the link there. Yeah. So... Yeah, no, so I've always been into music, long story short. Mm -hmm. I'm going to apologise from now. I'm a little bit long-winded. Spray's going to tell me off, so I'm just going to apologise from now. I'm no, sorry, it's just how thing. I talk. Um, what am I saying to you? So yeah, from young, just culturally into music. My brother was a DJ. Mm -hmm. His mates used to come around after school and mm. get on the old mic and, and the decks mm. and that. Mm. Bless my brother, man. He was so tolerant of me. Because he even said to me the other day, like, sis, I love you, but you are under my feet, boy. But mm. anyway, so I started spitting from that. And then... Mm. Yeah, yeah, because obviously I remember Channel U days. Um, I remember you had the clash with um, Shiesty. Mm. Um, Chanel. Yeah. So what was all that about? How did that come about? Because obviously we got the. Um, I'm on the really the, the most school. podcast. We've got, yeah, got, we got the new yeah. school. We've got the new school girls clash. We're gonna get into that with the current affairs there. Yeah. Lady Lee and Yeah, and so how did that start? That. Tell us, tell us how that started. Because it's all about the female, like UKB. Because I'll be honest, I'll be honest, I kind of right missed now. that, you know. I didn't, I like, I knew you lot had beef, yeah, yeah, mm. or whatever. Cause I remember the beef, but I didn't really check it. So on the way here, Coel, yeah, yeah, I was on the train or whatever, and I listened to um, the diss tracks and all that. Sorry, I'm invading your space there. Kind of. Sorry, pal. But it's cool. Okay. RTM podcast, look, my cushion. Mm. Oh, Very cosy, by the yeah, way. Yeah, so um, <laughs> I'm slightly trying to yeah. make it. Anyway, cos, yeah. Yeah. I was on the train listening to the, the Clash. And I'm not even going to lie, I think she kind of won, you know. Okay. Because I think it was easier for her because her thing was a comeback, innit? It seemed like, it seemed like your, when I heard it, I don't know, but when I heard your one, it sounded like your one was first. No, no, no. So this, this is, and this is the thing. It's I need to hear it. Her one just sounded it. mad, though. And she you know, I really crazy. respect you for saying that mm. because normally the first instinct of people is they mm. think, "Let me tell you what you want to hear," mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and I'm not built like that. Mm -hmm. Don't yeah, tell me mm -hmm. what you think I want to hear. Tell mm -hmm. me what you honestly no, no, feel honestly, honestly, and what resonates with you. She went in, she went in. I respect that. Okay. I need to, I need to hear them then, basically. Okay, so I need to, go on. I need to do a little bit of a disclaimer, right. and I tell you why. Mm -hmm. Because you probably heard this saying, yeah, because mm -hmm. there's industry mm -hmm. and there's industry. Mm -hmm. Now, when I say that, I don't mean gangster, retaliation with just violence and mm -hmm. ignorance and not trying to have mediation. That's not what I mean by industry. Mm -hmm. What I mean by industry is a code of conduct and a moral compass where you are authentic and true to your morals at all times. Right. No matter where you're at, the, the, rep, the branding deals at stake, you do what's right in the eye of the Lord, whatever mm. your God may be, and your upbringing, right? And what you know as right, mm. yeah? So anyway, with that now, with, with, with the clash and that, what happened is, and the reason, so I'm doing the disclaimer, I've gone a bit off track there, is you're because, no, sorry, cousin, I'll tell yeah, you why. It's very, when I tell you the story, you're going to understand why. The reason I'm doing this, I'm not trying to insinuate a past beef. You know what? Obviously, I had that madness with Shasta. Everybody knows about that, innit? But I'm not even going to get into that. That's old. It's cool. Snakes, you come across them every day. You come across a snake when you're going shopping, innit? People just hate. People are snaking. But what people don't understand, yeah? Unity is strength, yeah? And unless people start coming together, this scene ain't going to go nowhere. So what you'll do, you're going to hate on people. But the strong, survival of the fittest, yeah? The strong will always break through, innit? If you're gonna hate, 
Like, and your air, that's anything, isn't it? You need to be watching your game. But as I said, in it, unity is strength. Team. Let me break down team for you, yeah? Together, everyone achieves more. The reason right. I'm saying this, it got very serious. Mm. And parties were intimidated in the sense of I got calls by men older mm. than me having to squash it because of how somebody felt. Mm -hmm. So I know we can all do entertainment. I'm not going to talk for that. I want that person. I want Chanel to know your call cool because I know even you've said to people, you don't want me at parties because you're scared. Mm. You don't need to be. Let's, that we're big mm. women now. Mm -hmm. She's older than me. Let's have it right and not left. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, now what happened is, and Corey Johnson can verify all of this because when I talk, I talk facts where mm. people can verify, right? Mm. Corey was mentoring, looking after me at the time. Long story short, her management approached Corey and said, she's been signed, but she's struggling with the underground hype. No one's right. buying it, basically, is what I was told. Yeah? Okay. I met her and I thought she was all right, mm. Spray. I thought she was cool. I'll take you as you present yeah, yeah, and time cool, will man. tell, but she mm. was cool. Mm. So I said to Corey, I don't mind jumping on a track with her. And you actually touched on this on another show you done. Mm. We'll talk on it later. I don't mm -hmm. want to digress. Mm -hmm. So I said, I'll do the track. Long story short, we've done a track. We got a track called, I think it was Hold Me Down or something like that. Mm. Talking about sort of female empowerment and a sisterhood. Yeah, but in a mm. different way. Then another track came about in a studio. There were some artists there. And apparently, the well, I say apparently, the guy that suggested it called me and said, look, I wanted you on the track, Shizzle. I want you on the track. Mm. And it got shut down. I said, oh, well, that's cool. Like, whatever, innit? It then transgressed that it got shut down because if I was on tracks, I would take certain people's light. Mm. Mm -hmm. The boys didn't respect that because with boys in music, you guys don't do tracks like that mm. it's if the energy's real let's vibe it ain't like, about yeah. you're gonna outshine me brother yeah. i want you to shine and yeah. if you outbar me that day then you outbar me yeah and then in true lyricism and artistic yeah, I remember style, them you'll time, come back. Usual, usual, you've done things with Wiley and Skepta yeah. and GME and all that i remember you, you yeah. doing your thing still yeah, yeah yeah i've done a few things and that so anyway that i'll be honest with you that got back to me and i was a bit like wow because mm. i've jumped on a track with her from pure love of i want to see you win sis all of this because you're not robbing people and people think you're not gangster, they don't want to buy your music. I'll jump on the track with you. People are going to take you a bit more serious. Then mm. cool. Mm. Because you seem genuine to me. You're just a young black woman trying to get on and the market that I've got control of don't rate you. Mm. But I do. Mm. So I'll show them that I do. Yeah. So that was that. <sighs> Pulled her up on it, spoke to her about it. She diverted it. That was that. She then done a track on Westwood, a freestyle. I got a call and it was like, look, she's gone for you very indirectly. Yeah. Mm. Slewing me talking about you'll always be on the underground, bitch, please. Some nonsense. Yeah. I then done a uh, let's all not call names, but talk track. Yeah. And Jenny Francis played it when she was on Choice FM at the time. Love Jenny and Francis. then it got messy. I then started hearing Grease talk. Um, and then I just said, you know, fuck it. I'm not someone to be indirect, man. I'll call your name because mm. I, I, I can. Like, it, we're yeah. going to have the chat. We're going to have the chat. I'll call yeah. your name. Mm. So then I done the diss track on the lean back track. And then that went mad. Yeah. Long story short, she then done her track, didn't she? Yeah, she no, that, sorry. She was in uh, West Indies at the time. Okay. Her manager and her hype man done a track, Ronnie Red Eyes. <laughs> Uh, Fury, Gold Check, they put my address on the track. Westwood played it. Mad team. Yeah, because I was actually at studio and my cousin who's in PR called me and said, listen, I know, you, I know you can handle yourself. And my cousin's so down the line. She's like a professional woman. She's mm -hmm. not on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. She said, but listen, I'm hearing my auntie's address on Radio 1 mm -hmm. um, on a legal sense. If you need me to handle that, mm -hmm. give me a call. But mm -hmm. I'm just letting you know. And I was like, what? She was like, well, your mum's address has just been played on Radio 1. I was upset because I felt like, Westwood, why would you let mm. that slip through the net? I've spoken to Westwood, it's cool. We had a chat, I drove up to his show, we spoke after he come off air. Mm. Um, but I was upset because I know the protocol and you've not followed it correctly on that sense. Mm. But the violation, innit? Yeah. But again, I've been a youth worker from 16, innit? No one's going to come to my house. I'm, I'm not out here doing bad things. Mm. So no one, I'm not worried in that sense. So then that was that. Um, Cuz, look, 
your podcast is really the most, isn't it? Yes, I've never spoken. It. I've never spoken mm. about this, mm. but I'm going to be honest. Mm. And again, it's not to kick up dirt. Mm. I don't plan on releasing an album. I'm yeah. just talking from my heart. Mm -mm -mm. Um, I was in a car with Scorcher. So the clash has gone on. Mm -hmm. she, Ronnie Red Eyes, her manager released and she released. Mm. She put my mum on the track. Now what happened is when my mum heard the address, mm. <sighs> look, I don't rock with a lot of people. My mum's very close to me, innit? Mm. Um, Okay. It's cool, man. It's cool. Obviously, I buried my mum October in it, but it's mm. cool. I'm a human oh, in it. Come on, you so, know I love so my mum. Well. I know you did, cuz, yeah, but yeah. obviously, October it's December now, innit? Yeah, yeah. I'm know a human in it. I ain't fresh. doing this for no views mm. in it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But my mum was a serious woman. I mm -hmm. loved her in it. Yeah, come on, I know yeah. your mum, man. I know Charlie. <laughs> well, Lucy, but yeah, mm. dad, no, Charlie, 100. Your mum and Charlie. Yeah, 100. Sorry, I didn't hear you. Anyway, so my mum pulled me aside and said, listen, Daughter, Coel, Holly, Coco. Look, I get your music thing, but I didn't raise this. Um, mm. I didn't raise you to have my address put on Radio 1, innit? Mm -hmm. And furthermore, I will go and slap Chanel, innit? So either you deal with that and I want my address off every playlist. Yeah. Or you need to give me a number, innit? Mm. Mum, I'm dealing with it. Don't watch that. It's cool. Mm. Yeah? A few things went on. It weren't coming off the playlist. My mum said, no, 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 no. You see what I'm saying to you? You're 17 years old. I'm a big woman. And legally, they have violated. They have put my address on the radio call. Are yeah. you mad? It's not, I know you can slap people, but you're my, you're my daughter. I don't want you doing that. Yeah. Yeah? I'm going to take control legally now. And yeah. they're going to forward some peas. And they had to. Yeah? Mm. Cool. Anyway, so I'm in a car with Scorcher. All of this has happened. It's died down. I haven't seen Chanel. Yeah, big up Scorcher. Mm -hmm. Love big up Scorcher mm -hmm. and the new music. Hard. Mm -hmm. um, anyway, so I'm in a car with Scorcher. And Floyd, furthermore. Big up, big up your know. father. Big, big, don't know big, up, big up Scorcher father. <laughs> you get me? <laughs> love My that. old little jailhouse pattern. You get me? I love yeah. that. Um, anyway, so I'm in a car with Scorcher. We're talking about music. Mm. Right. <laughs> I kid you not. I look to my right. Chanel walks past my car with her little sister after you've just splashed my dress on Radio 1. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be honest with you. I became very upset instantly. I did. Did you stick it on her? You can ask Scorcher what happened. I'm not going to get too into mm. it, but I got out of the car and I just said to her, listen, me and you now, no listeners, what are you telling me? Mm. She froze. Mm. Rightfully so, I understand. I don't take pride in her freezing because I've been in positions where I froze, but... Mm. That was because people tried to bully me. I've mm -hmm. never gone to put mm -hmm. anyone in that mm -hmm. position. Yeah. I said to her, she was with her little sister, who must have been about 14 at the time. I said, you're with your little sister. Off of the back of that purely, I'm not going to do nothing to mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. Because if someone violated me in front of my little sister, A, you're never coming back from that in your little mm -hmm. sister's eyes. Mm -hmm. And she's never going to feel safe around you. Mm -hmm. And B, let's not do that in front of kids, in it. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you now, we can clash all day long. But if you put my address on a track again and I see you, mm. it's going to be a problem, isn't it? And look, the God has made us meet. So take heed of today and take heed. Don't take the kindness now for weakness. Anyway, she's left. Scorcher was in shock. He was like, blood, like what's happened? Like, raw. Like, did that really just happen? She mm. just walked past the car, yeah? Mm. Anyway, I'm not even going to lie to you. I've tailed after her because in my heart I felt like, no, but she's put your address on the track. Why are you letting her walk off? Mm. This long story is not being short, but I'm go sorry, sorry, no, go on, go on, go on. sorry, man. Because no, you know no, I'm what just it saying. is. Yeah. I'm just saying. Can no, I be on. honest? We're in a no, hear me. Do you know why it's hard mm. to be mm. short? Because yeah. I can be short. Yeah, yeah. We're in a world where people will take that shortness as yeah, yeah, the yeah, full no, course, context. Course, 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 yeah. Course, but anyway, so I, I kind of felt in my heart a bit like don't want to let her go off, but I did. I'm now in IKEA in Edmonton off the A406 with Cara. She's in there with her mum her dad, her sister, and a little sibling in a pram. She now puts it on me because I'm outnumbered. <laughs> you see the fuckery? Yeah. You don't get to see everything <laughs> in the music industry. You see the irony of that? I looked at her and I just said, listen, your mum's here. Let's do it outside. <laughs> mm. No, no, we can do it right here and now. We can get it cracking, you know? Mm. I said, yeah. Cool. It got cracking. Long story short, she drew the, long, she drew the, straw, the short straw. My sister had to get involved. It was fucking horrible. 
Yeah, my sister handled her and I had to handle her mum. It was fucking mm. horrible. Oh, mm. they, no, no. I don't yeah. take any pride in it. Her no, dad, I don't even want to laugh. No, I don't, but yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Um, no. Nah. I've had to be up a dad before. I had yeah. to put... Anyway, listen. Yeah, forget, that. forget that. But what I'm saying is, this is why people don't understand how hard it is to turn the other cheek. Do you know how many people have said to me, she took the piss out of you, you're a dickhead. So mumsy has got it and all that. Mad move. But, but do you see how her mumsy got it? I don't know how that story's been told. I've never told this story. Only my family know this. Mm -mm -mm. But I have to talk, innit? We're at an age RTM now where I can't... No, 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 but it's the truth. No, do you know why I laughed? Because, <laughs> because I've had you... to handle somebody's mum before. <laughs> but it's only because, like you said, and I don't know this situation. I've got nothing against shysty or anything like that. So it's not like that. But do you understand, like, it, the situation got like that and... It's not nice. It's not, so it's not a me, nice situation. On the clashing no. thing, I'll say this. I'm all for clashing because, look, if you go back to the 60s and the 70s, the b-boy culture, music culture, that's how mm. you spar. It was lyrical content or dancing and, oh, what? You're pushing the dimensions and the limits of music in that way. Let me up my game and push the right. fucking boundaries Air what, that yeah. way. Hear what? See, like when you, you had the madness with her and her mum and that, yeah? mm -hmm. was that before or after her... Uh, her, her um, after the address, that's how it No, after her tune, her tune, the tune that After. She, Oh, it was after. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, I, so it was the, it was a musical done, for you she anymore. Done, mm. What happened is, no, me, let me give the synopsis. She, she done a subliminal. I done a subliminal. I said, "Fuck it, call her name." Her manager and tour manager. The one I heard her of her once. Then subliminal she called. My, no, no, but this is it. Oh. The subliminal one. You're not gonna be high of the subliminal one because mm. she hasn't called my name. But yes, what she, she was saying, bitch, please, you're always gonna stay on the underground. When me and Shiesty were barring, who was she talking to? Because Dynamite was gone. Mm. Dynamite was in a different lane I was on the underground bar with man them Dynamite got a deal Big up Dynamite Because she inspired me To pick up the pen mm. But do you yeah, understand What I'm saying yeah. So you wouldn't know The history Because again Not everything gets documented mm, But you see what it yeah. is though See me yeah exactly. If I'll be honest here I hear bare you know yeah, you know madness know about that. Cream I hear bare madness Sometimes like I hear other rappers Saying things or whatever yeah. And it, it I think like Sometimes like my paranoia make me think, oh, they're talking about man. Yeah. But guess what? See, when they, you, you ain't even got the balls to say my name, so I don't even take it on. Yeah. 100%. Type of thing. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. that's what it is as well. It. Yeah, yeah, I don't even take it on. So it's yeah. like, she never said your name. But Cassie, I was 17. So what would make you was, take it on? But you know? the thing is, but I responded I to someone know, that didn't call is, my name. I know spray. the yeah, context. Yeah, yeah. She was chatting to me. me yeah, yeah, but it's obvious. Me, that was obvious. me and her are barring and are doing music and we're talking at the time. She's asking me to do appearances and to come to her studios and lay tracks. I've got two tracks laid with Shiesty. One mm. got released, one hasn't. Mm. She's asking me to lay. I'm turning up. When my management, Corey, are calling her management, she's not turning up. Mm -hmm. Then we hear the bit, the, the tune on the radio about Bitch Please Underground. Sorry, mm -hmm. the bar. Right. Come on. Who, it was a like, bait one. <laughs> but you're not going to say my name because this is how people move in it they mm. want the controversy but then when it they don't want it in a sense where it can be traced back no but I didn't say your name mm. no, but you didn't have to 80% of flipping communication is non-verbal anyway mm -hmm. it's the intent and how you do it come on man uh, cool so that was that that was what happened with that clash here so I would to be fair I could see why why you kind of got physical with her because her reply was mad still. It's nothing to do with her no, reply. No, 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 but, her conduct. Yeah, yeah, her reply was mad. Remember, but, she listen, tried yeah, it with me listen, first. Listen, sorry, yeah, because we got... No, but I have got, to be clear on I know, that. No, but we've got to kind of just move on, in it because we've got a lot to talk about, yeah? But, um, all right, so, cool, that was your clash. Um, you've done stuff with Titch as well, Free Titch. Mm hmm I saw that you get me crazy. Mm -hmm. um, so all of that. I've, um, I've not done a track with Titch. Me and Titch. No, have not gone, on just on we've, radio. We've gone we've on. Sets. Yeah, we've done sets. Done we've sets. gone abroad yeah, yeah, and done yeah. bookings and that. Yeah. Right. You get me. So um, yeah. No, so I saw one of the sets you like that. We know Titch is a mad man. So. <laughs> Listen, so, yeah. give Titch a, 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 a fair trial. I'm not even going to say free Titch. Yeah. I'm going to say give the man a mm. fair, fair trial. trial. Yeah. There's so yeah. much corruption. Titch never rife. done. Titch never done that. But yeah. Mm. Um, so. Um, yeah, free, free my, yeah, my, my jeans still. But um, yeah, so then um, you've obviously, you've had your highs and then you've had your lows because mm -hmm. obviously you went, you've just come out for, how long you been out for, of prison? I came out of prison in February. February, so that's 20, this year. 2020, yeah. 20, 20, okay, okay, so what did you go to prison for, sorry? For assault with the mitigating circumstances that I gave. So obviously... Right. A story was put in the paper, and I need to be very clear. Mm, don't go too into oh, no, it, but no, no, obviously, I, Scar City, I'll everyone I'll be honest with it. you, mm. Spray, I can't go too into it because mm. there's still legal things going on. Right. Mm. 
I'm still documenting things. Right. Mm. Do you understand? And yeah. things are being investigated because mm. you've got to understand it was defamation of character. Mm. The report that was put in the paper was written by the police officer who clearly expressed her emotional attachment in the case and her dislike for me before right. any evidence got given. Okay. okay. We, we, uh, we, we have don't to say need to pull out the violin. All right. Alleged. Just, just, just so alleged on my say, behalf yeah. and alleged mm. on her behalf. Okay, yeah. Right. So, so get all of that, that anyway, yeah. So what did you go prison for? I went prison yeah. for assault. Right. Yeah. You got found guilty One, for One, yeah? I went, yes, for two assaults. Mm. Right. I admitted what I'd done. I gave the context to what I'd done. Okay. Mm. And I have nine charges that mm. were brought against me. Seven of them were totally at the end. The jury said, this is mad. Like mm. what you people are trying to do here mm. is not right. Yeah. Cause so I, I, I don't want to talk read, too I much. Read, I will talk I read little time. bits on it. I read little bits on it. But no it one like, jumped out of a window. I was acquitted of forget that. Forget all of that. Yeah. But I'm just forget saying, all no, of that. It's this, documented. Mm, mm, but what I'm trying to say what's is. What's documented all, though? What no, but forget all of that. Forget all of that. No, but you can't forget all of that. Because you can't forget Egyptians' noses being smashed off the statues. Why I'm telling you this, yeah? Why I'm telling you? Because that's irrelevant right now. To you. All right, right now. It's irrelevant. Right, okay, cool. You get what I'm trying to say? Right now, it's irrelevant. That's cool. That's not what we're here to get into. 100% in that aspect. Obviously, the uh, main topic today is going to be freedom of speech. So maybe I'll let you have a bit more freedom, <laughs> freedom of speech of later. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to right now, cut you as well. Right now, no, no, you, know, it's just, on, like, you have to be no, come on, clear because people something, can misconstrue it's something, things. No, it's something that's that's obviously it's you. You're involved in that, in it. So. I understand. It's like what I said with the Dutch situation. I'll be going mad. So and it's, it's a like, very touchy subject you as well. Because... I understand, but what I'm saying is that obviously we have to understand. Like you know, there's there's a victim involved, so I can't really get into nothing. You get There's what I'm two to say? victims involved. You, clearly, but two. Let's, and yeah, that's but clearly, what we, but, that needs yeah, but to clearly, be clear. There's but two victims. Clearly, right. but my whole thing with that whole with that whole situation, yeah. Why I'm saying it's irrelevant because okay, cool, yeah. They've. I've taken this I own what I've right, done. Cool. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Sometimes which was not sometimes, domestic sometimes, violence. Yeah, but sometimes just accept stuff. So no, no, but no, 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 propaganda mm. when I know the documents in my bedroom mm. leave it there all next right, cool. question okay, so, boom. Cool. so even with all of that cream yeah mm. I was just like for what <coughs> you got sentenced or whatever yeah mm. and they said domestic violence or whatever see like they never said listen, domestic violence in the no, court no, though the no, paper no, I mean, what, what, pause what, again no look, mm. this is on camera please cousin mm. please mm. yeah the papers said domestic violence. The court said toxic uh, relationship mm. that ended bad for both parties. Mm. Right. right listen, Let's listen, be clear. There was listen, no journalist listen. in my court case. Can I say something? Can there I was say no something? journalist in Can my I court case. Yeah? So what you read was we're someone's talking, perception we're talking and about, emotion. We're talking about... A police officer. Can I talk? Can I talk? Yeah? Forget saying names and no, all that. Well, you, she's a public servant. Yeah, I, I know, can but say just her forget name. All it's that. public knowledge. I know, but... Yeah, Fed, that's corrupt. I will say her mm, name, cuz. Cool. I will say uh, her name. Cool. It's public knowledge. I'm uh, not doing allegedly. nothing in breach cool. of data protection. Yeah. I'm just gonna edit allegedly, that. in so my just, feeling, just, edit it out. Yeah. Then yeah. that's cool. But I'm going to speak my truth. Edit yeah. your yeah. thing, but I'm going yeah. to speak my truth. Yeah. Innit? Say, but There's but too much this, editing in today's society. Yeah, in these papers, too much innit? editing. Safe, yeah. Not with your thing. I'm saying in the newspapers. Cool. Yeah, but you're bringing it somewhere where I weren't even bringing it. Yeah. My whole thing is, all right, cool. You're a lesbian, right? I'm a lesbian. Right. So you like girls, yeah. Well, I like women. You like women. See mm, if, yeah, there's a I'm difference. Going, yeah, I'm going big mad difference. With my, I'm going mad with my freedom of big, speech. Big, big difference. No, you're not, you're not, you're not. I no, just but, like to be no, clear because people, no, unfortunately, no, 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 no. misconstrue on. things. Yeah, come on, listen. No, that's not your listen, fault. Listen, listen, though, yeah. I am with, listening with, to with, you With the thing, what I was saying is like... Sorry, I was pouring a little water. That's girl on girl. That's girl on girl, yeah? Like, if it was man on girl, like... It would be looked at as a madness. Mine would be getting a, a big spray. Break. Can I be honest with you? Mm. I don't want to talk about this matter yeah, because a, I, I haven't even healed from it. I was mm. in love with these people as much a person mm. as much yeah, as it was entertainment for people. Mm. I was in love with this woman, like, mm. <laughs> and like I said, there's still legal things going on. I've not like uh, look. I'm not anyway, ready to talk we're going to get into the, the facts. we're going to get into the freedom of speech later not on. The newspaper but we're going to we're going to get into yeah. that. We're going to get into current affairs now. So please, let's just get, get me. We're going to get into current affairs now. All right. Because um, 
That was just my introduction, innit? No, because of man you, on woman, woman on woman, woman if it's ill intent, is wrong. Yeah, yeah, my yeah, thing weren't what but, they put in the paper, so I don't want to. Because some mm, people are mm, getting beaten mm, up badly and things. I don't, mm, I'm not trying to step on anybody's thing, but mm, that's not my thing. Mm, but yeah. I also don't want to step on their situation because that is a serious thing. So man on man, woman on woman, cat mm. on dog, hurting someone's wrong cause yeah, in yeah, any yeah. sense, innit? Yeah, but they're just, they're just giving up. Yeah, I'm not a bully cause, I've been bullied, the innit? Them. Yeah, I've been bullied, it's not a joke mm. thing cause, and I'm not so ashamed what have to you say got, that. What, what have you got going on at the moment, Coel? <sighs> Let's talk right. about that. At the moment, I'm so focused on family stuff. Right. With Corona and everything happening, you know, mm. everyone's had to future proof and a lot's gone on. Mm. So we're just focusing on some family moves. Um, mm -hmm. And that's also keeping me really grounded, mm -hmm. really close with my little sister. You know, love, love her, man. She's a little sister, but like a big sis. Oh, um, big girl. Telling you, Cara, I love her, man. Mm. Um, and then obviously I've bought the trademark, mm -hmm. the uh, brand identity for Channel U. <laughs> Tell me where did all of this come from? Look, I was riding with you from the jump door. Tell me I've been messing with your headspace. I don't wanna hear no sentence start with I am not racist, stop it. More time when a man says that they are gonna say something racist, huh? So uneducated. Like a bird from a cage, free from holding on. The re up and get money in. Free all my brothers all trapped in the bin. Reminiscing when I used to do moves. Now I get paid off this music tin. Part time rapper, part time trapper. Take my word, I get this money in. I've been doing this for a long, long time. Ten years deep and I'm still going in. Um, yeah, that's big, that? that's big, yeah, that's Whoa. what I was going to come to next, yeah, so that's talk to us podcast, about that. That's another podcast, if I'm honest, I don't know if you guys got the time, but there's a lot going on. I made a move, right. didn't know about what was going on over there, with now what's transpired with Universal. Mm. Long story short, Universal were trying to, uh, well not trying to, they're taking me to court, mm -hmm. they reckon I shouldn't have the logo, they should have the logo. There's a lot more, I won't transgress, um, but yeah... That's what's going on. My intention was I had an idea. Yeah. Because in the background, as much as I don't do music, I work with a lot of artists. So mm, I, mm, mm. I understand the sort of current climate of the culture and the scene. Mm -hmm. um, and I understand it from the perspectives of not just the people that are winning, but the people that are being blocked or the people that aren't give, being given the fair opportunities. Mm -hmm. What's going on with Channel U? Cause? What's yeah, going on? So, so I'm building. Like so, 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 no, because people <laughs> wanted to know the politics. Yeah, There's yeah, been a lot yeah. of questions. So I'm currently at the moment just working with the artists that are about to come through. Mm. about to be the next biggest things in the UK and we're just documenting their journeys doing the videos getting the performances and just building the channel a lot of people and is that and is that is that underneath yeah, the she used to run channel U, so, so, she, so is that underneath going to be underneath the channel U umbrella like um, or are you still because of legal like you don't this, this is the thing this is what I'm saying how long have you got because remember, this is still a process. This is all still happening as much as you're asking me what's happening. Yeah. Do you understand? When I yeah. come out of it, there'll be calls being made about yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. 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 So we're building the channel. There's legalities going on. But what I will say is this. I've done nothing undercut. I've mm. done everything clean, mm -hmm. legal, by the book. I've applied a bit of business acumen and a few of the high and up, higher ups don't like it. But that's none of my business because mm. I'm allowed to eat. I'm allowed to use my brain. And it's as yeah. simple as that. I haven't robbed no one. You know what I wanted to ask you as well, Sorry. Obviously, the last episode, Big Up Bouncer, mm -hmm. prison, um, that one's been doing all right still, but I realise a lot of people are interested in yeah, prison. Big Up Bouncer. Where you've been prison, mm -hmm. like, I actually want to hear what female prison's like. Like, mm. what, what's that like, you know? Like, what's going on over there? Like, <sighs> wow, man. Like, First, do, they have, do they have, like, the square bit at the top of the... Um, the broom and because I used to hear they have the square at the top of the broom, so you so we got like the glider. So you there, was the, it. there was the glider. So you can't use it to like um, masturbate. You know, like the, um, oh, the, oh my that's God. what I heard. I swear, I've heard little things like that. <laughs> Fucking hell, the mass listen. Is that true? Oh, God. The, on the top of the um, no, so we've got fully that. functional brooms. There okay, were fully okay. functional brooms. There were glider okay. mops as well. Okay. Female prison cream mm. spray, but I'm saying cream as a woman. Mm. Mm sad oh yeah mm. heartbreaking yeah 
What's the banger? Like my like? belly just made a noise there. How like. many hours you lot doing bang up? We were actually quite fortunate. Don't get me wrong. When I was leaving, they started doing a bang up where you were doing like 18 hour a day bang up. That's what, 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 right, was, what was heartbreaking is, people's stories? Do you know what it is? What was heartbreaking? There's a lot of, um, a lot of young sisters in jail. Right, so you go gym. I worked in the gym, yeah. So I went to the gym, and then I was in the library. I really kept myself to myself. We'll talk anyway. But yeah. um, anyway, you speak to people. Are oh, you alright? You get to know a lot of young women in yeah. jail because of boys. I know, and I'm saying boys. Yeah, the correct term. They think love them. Mm. Meanwhile, dot com. While they're in jail, they're getting stories. My man's already breeded the next yeah. two things and got another case coming up with the next thing he's incorporated in his case. Yeah. And you're looking at this girl thinking you could be my niece. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Now, don't get me wrong. You've got got to take it with a pinch of salt. You know, everyone's got their learning, and you allowed that to happen as well. You know, but heartbreaking the rivalry, the way people set upon each other, each other. because they don't understand each other when all it could have taken was a simple conversation. From someone to say that. Yeah. Especially, come on, Cause, with females. Because, you know how much... And emotions and hormones. I think females are worse. There, yeah? Females are worse. Because no, I, I, my you, cousin's right. been to jail. <laughs> I know females that have been jail. And Cause? I've heard the stories, like, literally. <laughs> Trust they're me. To, they yeah. listening to Spree. They're listening. Listen, they come know on. everyone who's everyone they know. If you know what, one woman was trying to actually say, yeah, like the North, like, like I know Spree. I mean, I'm, I'm sitting there, yeah. I didn't say anything. Mm. I'm just letting her talk. Mm. And the more she's talking, I'm thinking, you don't know spray, don't but anyway. Know. And not even I can say I know you like that mm. spray, you know? I know what I've seen mm. and I've seen goodness, but I can't say I know you because I don't, you know what I mean? I'm mm. in your pocket like that. Yeah, but, well, I know but anyway, I just, I just let her talk. Well, you know, you know the vibes. Mm. But anyway, yeah, bare fans and that. But they know what's real, but then you can see the pretense mm, mm, as well mm, when you're mm, just mm, trying mm, to gas mm, and cling on names. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, bare fights, though. So, for example, do you know, this is what I'm saying. Oh, my God. So obviously canteen, I didn't know about canteen until about two weeks in. Mm. I'm a bit of a geek, introvert, confident one, but yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm focusing on my case. I'm trying to get a bell. I'm trying to come out of here because mm. the way I got remanded was ridiculous as well. This is what I'm saying. I was in prison on remand for a majority of the seven months I'd done waiting for a case. It mm. wasn't a sentence. Mm. But anyway, so um, <laughs> I've gone in. Girls are fighting over fish fingers and chicken nuggets that they've not even cooked themselves. Mm. And about 50 hands have touched them nuggets, bruv. Mm. And you're going to tear out someone's weave for them nuggets because of ego and pride and I can get in the front of the line first. And I'm looking mm. at these girls thinking, whoa, did you get me? Yeah. Mm. I, think, I, for, I yeah. think girls can find anything to yeah, argue about. Because though, as like, well, the emotion, it's yeah, heightened. Yeah. The menstrual cycle comes, then yeah. mm. one ovulates, then ten my ovulates. My my um. Somebody close to me yeah, that, that went to jail. <laughs> that must be mad still like Somebody everyone on close to me that, that went to jail said that um, everybody's cycle gets synced. Yeah, exactly. Everybody that's syncs nature, up, right? yeah, yeah, and then everyone comes if on at the same time. So, yeah, together, that, yeah, our periods will sync. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah it women. Happens, that's real life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. women that if mad you spend time yeah. together, you notice that you at the same time. Crazy. But do you know what it is, Cream? Like a lot of people. They're just hurting. Mm. And I think because obviously, remember, I'm 34 now. I've just turned 34. I'm an auntie. Lady Fury, yeah, thank you. I'm proud of what I've done and I love my supporters because they've yeah. rocked with me, you know, even through the turbulence. But the reality is I'm an auntie, innit? So I'm not on... I'm I know how to pick my battles wisely, innit? And I'm definitely not fighting did you um fingers. Did you meet anybody in there? Like, make any, like, close friends or you know meet what? anyone I special? I made two... You, again, I had to learn this quickly. A problem with me, Cream... I can be quite naive in a sense of I want to give love to everyone and as much I take people at face value mm. and sometimes I take that too trustingly and that's got me in trouble, yeah? So that happened with me at first. Then I learned the politics of jail and a couple older women took me in and were like, you are an older soul. Yeah. Not that I was trying to hang with young ones because I weren't, but they could see, I guess, that I was just going to the gym and studying and I was doing my own thing. But obviously everyone needs a conversation. You can't isolate like that. Although I can, that's that's I think that's what scared people because they were like, "We're putting you in seg." I was like, "Come on then!" Mm. Like I'd done two months isolation in seg with no telly in it. Mm. Like I can read. I will do push ups. I will meditate. I will look out the window. I will vision things. You can't. Yeah, you're hold like me. one of the man names. Yeah. So anyway, so it was just mad. And then, um, as I say, people were hurting. The older lady sort of brought me and they could see that I weren't on that. Mm. But even like there was one girl, yeah, that was so on me in jail in a sense of, sorry, my friends. I did two of the people that, let me shout them out, mm -hmm. Amani and Sophie. 
Again, Sophie yeah. used to work for the fucking home office, bless her. Mm. So down. You know, a real one. I don't want to talk her thing, but yeah. so down. That's why she's there. But her thing is true love. Mm. But fucking hell, such an intelligent woman, but made a bad decision. Yeah. And Amani, fucking hell, did do something, but mm. not in the context. Again, mm. it got portrayed. And again, as she was a lesbian woman, and she told me her case, they just didn't get her. And I understand, because I'll be real. People look at me and say, rah. Mm. Yeah, see Armani, beautiful, but I know certain men shiver when they see her in it because she can do her thing in it. Yeah, yeah, there were warrior women in history in it. So, mm. I know it sounds freakish to some people, but women some people being warriors don't get it, ain't they, strange. Yeah. She, like this some been happening yeah. in history, so <laughs> exactly. Yeah, they're men that are shivering. Um, I don't know about their Well, still. this is it. They're not real men, though, are they? Even, even, if even if it's even if it's a strong man, I don't know about their men that are shivering when Armani comes around still. Yeah, I don't think I'll, I'll, I'll shiver if I'm on the camera. We're in a different you. way. You're not intimidated by things that are different or what yeah. you might not perceive to understand at the time and you're willing to understand and you, yeah, go, big on, up you go on respect. You don't go on. Big up <laughs> money, but she can know what was the, um, <laughs> <laughs> what was the What was the hardest? <laughs> know yourself. Know <laughs> yourself, <laughs> No, I love Armani. G. But yeah, so them two, sorry, Cream. That's all right. Real solid relationships. Um Met some in there, came out the gate, and then you see very clearly, yeah, you're full of shit. Yeah. And then they're back in. I'm yeah. not I'm not going back to jail, so we can't be brethren. Because mm. you're going to jail for drunken and disorderly. You're yes. not even making money and doing it with some integrity. Like, yeah, it, sounds, it sounds nuts, it's messy. Man. That's not my life. Sounds I don't nuts. associate with things. It like. sounds nuts. But let's yeah. move on from prison. Yeah, man, sorry. The whole of the last oh, yeah. episode. I just, I, just, yeah. I was interested because... It's, it interests it's, me. Yeah, it's sad. It's sad, you know, but there like are things some I've heard people, about yeah. women in um, prison and all that. So it just interests me. What's current at the moment? Right. So basically, there's this rapper list that's come out, and um, all the blogs have gotten on. Oh, with the tears well. and all that. Yeah, basically. Oh yeah, I posted it on um. So there's the podcast a list. Page. Hold on a minute. I'm sure I had it on. Is this an, a current list, like a current, current spicy for two, hot for off the press, yeah? yeah so for basically oh, they're saying so many, that, um, hold on, let me just I've go got on it, got the, on the um, Have you got it on the RTM podcast? On the podcast page. Yeah. So imagine I'm on there as well. It's got the tier one elite, elite list. Yes. They're saying Stormzy, Dave, J Huss and A Tracy. That's elite. Yeah, then what's the next tier? Tier two. Are you get are you getting that? There's a whole heap of tiers. So basically, sure. yeah. So it's broken down into how many tiers is there? There's so there's six tiers, yeah. Okay. So they've got elite, then they've got tier two, talented but not elite. Okay. Fallen off, tier three. Okay. Tier four is underrated. God. Tier five is on the come up, and tier six is overrated. All on. Okay. Right. So there's been a tier lot. Tier two, talented. Tier three falling off. Yeah, so basically there's been a lot all on, of all discussion. Wait, 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 wait. They're trying to say the, the landlord's falling off. Hold on a minute. All so on. basically, they've got who they got on the falling off. They've got Crepton Conan falling off. But sometimes people are Feckle taking it. a break. Nah, man. It, Do you understand? That's I what I'm saying. This, 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 I don't say they're falling off. I think this list is a bag saying, of shit. They just saying, sometimes saying music people out. are are they're not falling off. They've had they've taken out. a break. Because a lot of people well, on this list, a lot of people, a lot of people on this list to me, want to see their daughter exactly, take their first exactly. A lot of people in this list are putting work and they're hard. Do you understand? Blade Brown, Blade Brown is hard. Hard. Fact. Do you understand? Fact. Hard. You can't say he's falling off. You can't. Is hard. You can't not put Chip um, in the elite. Crept and Conan is hard. Is he not? No, he's not in the elite. They've got so um, Skeptar's not in the elite. They've got um, who else have they got in there? They got Fecky, Wiley, Ambush, C. Steph London should be in the elite and Gets. Gets. Come on, Gets. Yo, listen, yo, huh, yo, yeah. on the real, hood lads far from a joke, man them land in a road with a pole and coat, to the youth them schools a joke, they ain't got no goals, that ain't, they ain't got no hope, out in the quick roll, out for the quick dough, and the sound bits all they know and don't try, tell them otherwise, you might end up with the Lord in bluey skies, it's no surprise, we're coming from broken homes, we clap crows, we clap bones, we clap holes, we clap roads, snatch bones, and the demons show when the anger explodes, and the road is deepened, you either eat or get Eaten, it's smoking season. You in this ghetto we live in. You stay killing, you stay out for shilling. Goods get taken in minutes. It's far from a joke, but the ends ain't killing. So you in this ghetto we live in. You stay 
kidding. You said I was shitting. Could get taken in minutes. It's far from a job that the ends ain't kidding. Late written, I'm part of the reason the crime reach risen. I leave home with a blink from the kitchen. Wrapped in a cloth, it's a wrap with it's off. I'll make a division. Please don't tempt me. I don't care if you're known in your zone. Believe in those MC. Don't go against me. Cause eventually, my life will make entry. And where I'm from, it ain't friendly. Niggas wanna end me. I'm trying to see peace of a GT Bentley. Some pick up a print cause I'm an MC. Deep down, is it envy? They must think I live rent free. So many cruel intentions. Nobody fools a prevention. So we walk a protection. I look at my enemy, it's all a reflection. You mean it's get over you think? You said killing. You said I. I'm shitting, but get taken in minutes. It's not from a job like the ends ain't kidding. I'm furious, get all living. You said killing, you said I'm for shitting. Good get taken in minutes. It's not from a job like the ends ain't kidding. It's a furious, get all living. You said killing, you said I'm for shitting. Good get taken in minutes. It's not from a job like the ends ain't kidding. It's a furious, get all living. You said killing, you said I'm for shitting. Good get taken in minutes. It's not from a job like the ends ain't kidding. Listen, I leave home with a clean heart, but I'm quick off the mark. Don't hype, I'll tear you apart. The back steep, I don't. Heart of an angel, brains of an eagle I can't move with these shadow people I've got a lot to lose and nothing to prove You've lost your mind, you couldn't walk a mile in my shoes And who you kidding? People prey on my down for the whole good feeling And all this due to one way fibbing I really hope the Lord forgives him But I still won't walk with a grudge, still won't judge It's a furious ghetto we live in But my levels of thinking are turned up a nudge It's a furious ghetto we live in You said killing, you said I was shitting Goods get taken in minutes It's far from a job like the ends ain't kidding It's a furious ghetto we live in You said killing, you said I was shitting Goods get taken in minutes It's far from a job like the ends ain't kidding It's a furious ghetto we live in You said killing, you said I was shitting Goods get taken in minutes It's far from a job like the ends ain't kidding It's a furious ghetto we live in you said killing, you said I was shitting Goods get taken in minutes It's far from a job like the ends ain't killing 100% good. I would put mm. Steph London in talented, but not No, I'd put her in elite cause, because she's. Oh, for, for what? She's done it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For Come the on, ladies, man. yeah. You can't say she's not elite and they're more elite than yeah, Steph. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come Def, on, man. Yeah, for real. Come on. Man. I was just talking like my taste. But I yeah. think mm. there's people Come that can I definitely bar think she's talented. Steph, I do that's think me. Steph that's what I meant. I meant if you're talking like in what she's done, then yeah, she should in regards to the females. When I say elite, in regards to talented. Um, elite for me is spin my head yeah. out of this world. There is no blueprint that will duplicate another so base, one of them. So I could make another Steph London. So did no you hear? No, they said overhyped. J one. You can't make another. J one. Ain't J one the producer? Ain't J one the producer? Oh. And, I was about um, to say these, that producers. And sick. big up Miss La Familia. I like her. I don't J5, think she should I'm be going in the J five. That producer. Miss La Familia. I actually like her. I don't think She's she should have been cool. in the overhyped. Was she in overhyped? Yeah, they put her in overhyped. I don't think so. I think she put I in a lot of work. She's Miss in work. Yeah. I saw her do a lot. Like, I don't think so. See, my I see thing a few is, on the I'm list all that, for the having a laugh and a yeah. giggle. I don't follow these blog sites and that. But you see when we're into tearing down. No, underrated. No ladies so underrated. Really no ladies underrated. She's on there, yeah? Yeah, I think Who she else is underrated. underrated? Underrated by Scorch the is underrated definitely as well. Underrated definitely. Scorch is underrated as well. Scorch is definitely he's lyrically, underrated. He's lyrically sick. Mm -hmm. um, but but who's underrating under them? This is what I'm saying. Because the, the, the right people see. rate them. It's the people that need to rate them are acting like I they can't you, see I it you. here. I hear you, I hear so you. this is another conversation. But yeah, no spray. But yeah, I didn't they, they left you off the list. They always put me off. But I don't ever put no music out in 220 anyway. Two five, it says based on 2020, but they always miss me out anyway, car. They're shook to put my name down. So Get did me? you, um, so another thing, did you see the Ivorian doll? The, no, the Lady oh, LaShaw. I, I saw the Lady LaShaw mm. one. Is it the birthday present? Yes. I watched the you don't want smoke, I'll keep you blunt. Law, it's a publicity stunt. Yes. Trying to make it seem like it's because of my video when it's been one year and nine months. Huh? Oh. Something don't add up. Hmm. Trying to use my name for your new stock. Yeah. Wanna play my games, get a new knocks? What are you tap? Huh? Get a new stock. That, hey, Lady LaShaw is a madness. I don't know. Big not, up Lady LaShaw. Yeah, no, big no, up no, Lady no, no, no. LaShaw. You smacked it. But she, basically, I just want to say to the new Jenna female spitters, don't send for the old school chicks. Like, just don't do it. Like, 100%. don't do it. You will get spun. Like, don't do 100. it. No, Each some, and every some, some, some I'm not saying that. I never well. said that there's not good ones. That but, can hold it. I think. But. That La Vida, La, whatever her name is. La Vida Satam, yeah? What, La Vida? La Vida. La Vida Loca. La Vida Loca. That's her name, La Vida Loca. Yeah. And T but, Santos, um, Coley's artist, is bad as well. Mm. I, was, I was watching her the other day, whatever her name mm. is, T us, whatever, but she's bad. I need to take her in more because yeah, no, she's no, a bit she's young bad. from you having no, checked no, no, her properly. I, ch I, checked it in, I checked her out last night. Yeah. Her and um, 
Who else did I just see? But so um, La Vida Loca, yeah, okay. they're, they're actually sick. So far, <clears throat> everybody that's sent for someone that came before them, mm-hmm. it hasn't happened. Even in regards to me, like, it's just not happening. I don't mm. think so. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if it's because we come from an old school generation. You know, like we come from clashes and mm-hmm. we know about when it comes to mm. that type. That's how we do it. Mm-hmm. It's more of that. But yeah, well, I mean, she I killed her though. She definitely well. gave her heads, some birthday beats. But mm. I, I did feel, um, I do like Ivory and Dodo. And um, I do think she's got a vibe about her. I like I like the one they done but that they took school down... girl video thing. I do like the vibe, but I do. Yeah, see that's it who very, we're talking I about. See it very poppy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. I, I think she's got Lole a young her no, no. Or Lashur and her in the same context because even though Lashur is still quite mainstream, she's not gimmicky. Ivorian doll for me is quite gimmicky. Talented. Because mm. I can I respect the gimmick lane. Uh, yeah, I'd what have I've to... seen is I saw like a Britney. For me, it was Britney Spears on yeah, drill. Yeah, that's what I saw with yeah. catchy punchlines and a pa- so. Yeah, but fair dudes, you've put that package together. It's worked. Do your thing. There's but, a lane for gimmicks. No one. I'm not putting you down for that. Sister, but what I know is that you. um that Lashaw came for her on her birthday and said I served you a gift or something. Yeah, but that's what <laughs> Ivory and Doll really done that. to um Miss Fabulous. She her daily duppy dropped on her birthday. Okay, know so I didn't where know she either. sent for that's when she sent for her basically, and then Ivorian, um, I mean, um, Miss Our Fabulous, mm-hmm. no, must killed her on a diss track as well. Okay, so it's just loads of female stuff going on at the moment. Like, but sis, you know what it is for me, cream. It's just so I, much look, Like I said, I don't mind on. clashing when it's people showing lyrical ability. You get me? Sometimes it can go left because the chemistry, but I'm always trying to have that manners and respect. Mm. Doesn't need it can all be lyrical and be fun and be artistic without being naughty in it. But sometimes mm-hmm. people don't know manners and respect in it. Mm-hmm. But my thing is, for me, there's not enough queenship. It's all good you guys are calling each other's names and that. And I know I've clashed shysty. Yeah. But remember, this is why context and I kept cutting you, Spray. Mm-hmm. It was so important. I tried to build with her before I had to build like do what I had to do. Mm-hmm. My intention is always going to be for the greater good. But mm. People take kindness for weakness and then it ends up in what it is. But what I'm yeah. saying is, is more real togetherness. Stop this whole she's a queen as well. I'll tell you why, because there's not one queen in music. Exactly. People label it like there is because there ain't one king in music. Mm. Stop that bullshit. Mm. You can't be screaming Black Lives Matters. You've smashed the noses off our Egyptians, but then we're not documenting artists that have come through and done bits like Spray. Mm. is a prime example of that. Mm. Kano, mm. prime example yeah, of well, that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, definitely. and that's what I'm on. Give everyone their dues, whether Everybody. they're a gimmick or whatever they are. But people have done work, and for me, there's a lot of nonsense going on. And definitely. quickly before I get long winded, part of the reason why I bought the Channel U logo and identity, and the reason, cause as well, why I'm not talking too much about what I'm doing. Not mm. a lot of people wish me well. Mm-hmm. And my brain, I know how special my brain is, and I'm not going to talk my blueprint on a camera. You have mm-hmm. to pay me for that consultancy. Mm-hmm. Mm. So I'm going to be real. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I think now we're gonna move on to the main subject. Have you got any any other um, current um, affairs? Because what else was there? She's so long winded. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Me. You know I'm the one day that we're gonna end up having the, the final so, topic of about like, five minutes long. Did you lot, lot? Did you lot hear? Talk to me about the man that got jailed for four weeks. Or riding across the Irish Sea to go yeah, see, see his a man girl. Post, uh, see a, <laughs> what? Imagine a man added me. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I'm cream. Done. A man added me and said because he he, he rode jet his jet ski in it to see his girl in lockdown or something. But a man's added it and added big bad spray and said, "Oh, mm. drive on a band to see your girl G." Because <laughs> remember my two, like, oh, drive mm-hmm. on a band. Mm-hmm. A man mm-hmm. my girl, yeah. he's added me. Yeah, you get what oh, I'm saying. Yeah, no, he, I never heard of that. I drive on a band. I drive on a band to see my girl, but I don't know about the jet ski car. You know what? If you fall down that like you're swimming with sharks, which is what men do every day, but <laughs> he yeah, um he basically <laughs> he basically <laughs> thought it was gonna take like forty minutes and ended up taking him like hours because like I'm he got done. into he got caught into it, rough though, sea and stuff like that. But it must have took him more than hours. Could you he got imagine? Nicked. Like that's crazy. Skirt. But when he they pull you, his heart's going. Like, yeah, not today, babes. Not happening, babes. But and yeah. then basically, like last but not least. We're in tier four lockdown, whatever the fuck that is. Like, what do you think of all of that, though, you lot? Yeah, that's all mad, man. I'm not even watching all of that, man. That's, uh-huh. 
I'm not even watching that. That's all. That's the next podcast. I'm keeping my immune system right. healthy and I'm just staying close to God and you can die at any minute anyway and I'm just treating others how I want to be treated, mate. And keep I've, already, I've already said what I've got to say about <laughs> That's all I lockdown. can say to Corona and bring check, on 2021, please. Check um, the mental health episode featuring Fastlane Wes if you want to hear what I've got to say about the whole COVID thing. I'm not going to repeat myself. Mm. I'm not going to go over what my what I think my thoughts think. Check out episode two in the mental health but obviously i see with the whole vaccine thing i'm just going to mm. quickly talk about that mm. like you know they're saying everyone this vaccine everyone's gonna have to have the vaccine i see everyone like no i'm not taking a vaccine i'm not taking a vaccine <sighs> i'm gonna be the first one to take the vaccine i'm not really yeah. well i'm gonna joke. be i'm it's gonna be one of the last ones to it's take not a the joke. vaccine can I, can I finish um, it's not a joke yeah let me tell you why i'm gonna be the one of the first ones to take the vaccine because i like to fly right i like to go places I like to, and how they're gonna they're gonna make this thing where you need this vaccine to be able to get on a plane. You need. I I need to go Dominica. I need to go and see my people. I need to, and I heard if you had um certain man, I hear like I'm 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 with man of mine. Like I'm not taking this vaccine. I'm thinking, but blood, I was with you lot. Like we we was raving. You was taking diesel and all that. Like you, I I see you sniffing and that. And you're not taking a vaccine. A but the thing is, yeah, but not you like know, that, but you know, I'm this thinking all on a minute. Doing worse, bro, I'm thinking all on a minute. Mm. Man, I'm going like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not taking this vaccine, and but I'm thinking, brother, you're not taking this vaccine, but you're taking a whole like you're you're taking more risks than the vaccine, brother. It's yeah. mad the way they're gonna box us in but, with it. Um, yeah, but yeah, gonna, it, it hasn't been out long enough. But so everyone nobody saying they're knows not what the take side the effects exactly. are. My thing mm. is this: COVID has just come, and mm. they've just made a vaccine. Normally, whatever they make, they spend years, you know, like testing it mm, on mm, things mm. that we don't even know what one year in side effects no, I see, look I like. I see all of that online and everyone, everyone saying? saying they're not taking like, the vaccine. I don't that, agree they, with it. They're staying in their yard saying that. Well, so I'm, you're saying I'm, you're not going to take the vaccine, but you're listening to all but the you other know shit. What? I was listening you're wearing to, masks. I was you're listening not going to take the vaccine, but you're, you're listening to other bullshit. And then they still that. Me and my man was listening to LBC, yeah. Check you Yesterday. out. Yesterday. got rich. Nigel Farage, yeah? No, but the thing is, like, we was listening to LBC when they announced the tier four. They and Because um, I like to, you know, <laughs> you know, just, like, hear other people's opinions and things like that. Yeah, it's good. And um, <clears throat> there was people calling in, and they was literally so upset with all of this tier four. Mm. Like, they, one of them had, like, an elderly grandparent that lives in tier three that she's not allowed to go and see mm. for the whole of Christmas. They don't know when it's going to be lifted. She's there at her, on her own. Like, Eve, like, you know, like it's okay for people like us, but there's a lot of vulnerable and the elderly, elderly disabled that have literally just been locked up. Like, like they're in prison and right now. And their anxiety heightened from the propaganda on the right, news. Right, their yeah. mental yeah. health and that right now is at an all time high. And yeah. there's not, there's, there's no support system for them. It's mm. true. All they've been told is they've got to stay in. Do you understand what I mean? Mm. Like, do you get me? And I really mm-hmm. feel for those type of people at the moment. You can't fly out. People want to fly out. There's no information being given. Like, you don't just and announce the information it. information like, is contradictory. Yeah, it's if you shit. actually check the stats and the publicists... It's bullshit. Um, Boris is the a bag of fucking shit. of the governments and where they publish all their stats, none of them actually correlate and are consistent. Go and do your own research. You can get these websites in Google. You can see what is a government official website and what is a company site. Do your mm. research here. Yeah. What you're saying about the old people, it's true. Yeah. I took to yeah, sorry to cut you. It's, it's is. distressing. And, and they don't, everything is check gov.org and all yeah. that. A lot of them, they don't even know but how to do, do all of that. Check the government in this country's website and then check Holland and start looking at the numbers because they've got the UK numbers in them websites as well. Mm. And they're all different. But do your own research. I don't, I'm not a conspiracy theorist. Do your own mm. research. The thing about the old people, what's sad, my nephew's mm. football, a girl said to me, Co, my nan won't even come past the steps. No. She's so mm. scared no. by the news. My grandparents and we're trying to are tell the her, same. Like, right now, but you're okay, they won't you let know? us in. Mm. We have to go to the door. My yeah, grandparents, yeah, yeah. That mom. they're not having it. Hayley's and even, that, yeah. and because obviously we, we're getting our information from different places. So, you know, like we're more, you know, like we've got our opinions about, they don't want to hear that. They will watch the news. They're listening to what the news says. And my grandparents have literally been locked in their house from before. Mm. Do you understand Sad, what I'm saying? Yeah, they're yeah, and it's yeah. not right. They do get scared. And yeah, yeah, yeah. loneliness is a killer as it, well. Exactly. Let's not forget it's not the that. Great, it's not the greatest way to live. And I just feel like they just, yeah, like they're at the end 
even yesterday on the radio, like a lot of people saying, remember, they're at the end of their t- of their lives now. Mm. You know what I mean? Do you yeah, get what yeah. I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And they should just be able been, to enjoy it. Do you understand what exactly. I'm saying? And, and you're be telling them, every day. you're exactly. telling them With that people, that your own if family right can't come to the yeah. house and whatever. Mm. And I don't, I'm, I'm saying this. I don't agree. I, I don't, I don't believe in this COVID-19 yeah, neither do I. Yeah. I know it's a conspiracy. No I'm not asking. I'm saying. I'm, I'm telling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. you're rating that. No, one. no, no. I'm but I'm. Asking, yeah, I'm not you. asking. I'm. Yeah. I'm saying it. Come yeah, on. I telling, already telling, know telling. what they're out here doing. It's a. It's a 2020 genocide. Mm. Do you understand? They're making a, a, a designer country. Yeah, and they're trying to collapse the fucking economy. Mm. Do you get me? That's what it is. They want us to work for them. They saw a lot of us making our way out. All this ownership. Everybody becoming their own boss and everything. It's so much bigger than us. Right. And they cool. fooled a lot, a lot of people. This, this get here, me? That is definitely a wait, strand. Let me just, let me just, let me just go into this now. I loads definitely more. second that. We've, we've been talking for so long, yeah? No, it's we just go, let's, let's, go into, let's, go, let's go into the, the main subject. Yeah. Like, <laughs> okay. You know what I'm trying to say? Cause we've been oh, shit, yeah, freedom of speech. We've been having freedom of speech, isn't it? Yeah, 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 of course, of course, of course. That's what happens. I'm saying, yeah, yeah, of course. Sorry, God, sorry. This is the main subject now, yeah? Them in. Um, yeah, so I wanted to talk about freedom of speech because it seems like nowadays, yeah, <clears throat> it seems like our, spe- our, our speech is like policed way more than it used to be. But um, yeah, so let me go into the, um, I swear I even Googled it all. <laughs> yeah, freedom of speech. Uh, yeah, freedom of speech is a principle that supports the freedom of an individual or community to articulate their opinions and ideas without fear of retaliation, censorship, or legal sanction. Eleanor Roosevelt and the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, 1948, yeah? Mm -hmm. Article 19 states that everyone has the right to freedom of opinion and expression. This right includes freedom to hold opinions without interference and to seek, receive, and impart information and ideas through any media and regardless of frontiers. Yeah. So basically like we're all entitled to an opinion, you mm-hmm. know, without, but obviously they've had to change it and, you know, bring in stuff like libel, slander, obscen- yeah. obscenity. Cause obviously you can't mm-hmm. just and you say can't anything. Incite, you, because, can't incite yeah, hate you can't just say like anything. That, yeah, like, yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? Cause we wouldn't like, like we have a problem with people calling us nigger or you can't just say anything. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm trying to say? So I, I get that in it. So it's like, Freedom of speech, but I, I also, with the whole thing about opinion, yes, I think we should all be able to have an opinion as long as you can explain your opinion, you can express your opinion in an articulate way, or you've got, like, it's not filled with hatred. Mm-hmm. It's coming from a, um, you know, from a, from a, I don't know, from a pure side. Mm-hmm. Like, it's just your opinion. You know, some people might have an opinion based on their religion. Some yeah. people might have an opinion based on their upbringing, mm-hmm. you know, some people, but it's just your opinion. Mm-hmm. And that's what I even say when I say a lot of things, it's like, it's my opinion. It's like, for instance, like, um, it's like a lot of people scared to talk about the gay stuff. Mm-hmm. Sorry, because yeah, the gay obviously. stuff is fine. No, but, you know, yeah, but, because, yeah, but in this, but, in this, this how you talk, I no, know but, you're yeah, not yeah. being rude and I have the mm, patience mm, to understand how but, others talk before yeah. I attack their freedom of speech. Like, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. So it's like, but even, even it's like, for instance, like with me, cause yeah, um, I posted a, a track called Heterosexual Pride. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's called Heterosexual Pride. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And within <laughs> I love you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Within <laughs> ten minutes, cause yeah. Within you ten minutes, the gay it, was, it, was, front door. it was the it was it was gone. Did you yeah? have the rainbow police? So it yeah. was gone, it was I gone anyway. I can say yeah. that on the biggest game gone. in the village. It was gone, but basically, yeah, my whole, I was just trying to have an opinion. So I've got not you know I've got nothing against Not at all. Like I used to, but that's because of my upbringing, mm. you know? And, but because of my upbringing, like, you know my mum, yeah? Rest in peace, yeah? Mm-hmm. So in, in Dominica, when I was growing up, like, for instance, if I bend down, funny, my mum, yo, yo, don't yeah, bend, yeah, like, yeah. Don't, don't bend down like especially that. You're bending like, down like a back, like, yo, it's, you're my like, West she's making me, in West like, I've got to bend cultures. down properly. I can't bend down with my bum in the air. That's mad for my mum. So <laughs> even that's how I've grown no up. Yeah? up for that's, boys, that's how I've grown I mean? up. Yeah. So it's like even if I'm walking, if I'm walking a bit funny, if I'm walking a bit funny, she's doing? slapping me in my back. Like yo, straighten up your back. Like so that's how I was brought up. Yeah. Alright, cool. So like this is my mum. Yeah. So like we've we've moved to England. 
And you know, the whole... So you was born in Dominica, yeah, Rosa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So not Rosa, but okay, I was born in Dominica, yeah, jump yeah. Trying gun. to act like you know Dominica, jump, jump but yeah. Gun. Boom, right, so anyway... I'm still a tourist in the backyard, listen, I'm not yeah. going to lie to you. Listen, listen though, yeah. So we've come to England now, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, obviously, my mum was a teacher. She's, you get what I'm saying? But, but what I'm talking by the end of her life, yeah, mm. she was telling me, like, no, um, you can't, don't be like that. Um, you know, she's telling me, like, everyone's equal blah 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 because one of her best friends was gay because mm-hmm. mm. okay. you know she used to do the um the carnival stuff yeah so one of her best friends was gay so it's like she changed the whole mindset mindset so because of her changing her mindset it's like i don't agree with i don't agree with it because religiously or whatever but i've got no problem with it mm-hmm. mm. do you get what I'm i've got no problem with it because at the end of the day to me yeah i feel like we've all got things that we all have things that we might not agree with with someone else. Like you might not agree with something I do. Mm-hmm. I might not agree with something you mm-hmm. do. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? We've all we're not mm-hmm. perfect. None mm-hmm. of us are perfect mm-hmm. on this planet. Yeah, none of us. Are, we all sin. Yeah, mm-hmm. and as far as far as I'm concerned, no sin is greater than um, the other sin. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Like obviously, that's in 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 in, in a lot in my God's eyes. Mm-hmm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? So, and. Another thing is like, there's not one of us on this planet that's going to escape judgment. Mm-hmm. So, right. Or hasn't sinned. He without that, sin cast the first stone, Yeah, isn't but it? there's not one of us that's going to escape judgment. So my whole thing is, worry about your own judgment. Mm-hmm. Don't worry about someone better. else's judgment. Mm-hmm. So it's like, so with that, in, with that in mind, I should still be allowed to have my opinion. Yeah. yeah. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Because I don't hold nothing against anyone, mm-hmm. but it's my opinion, mm-hmm. you know? And, I feel like sometimes the opinion of like say a heterosexual mm-hmm. is it's like it gets it gets put down, you know? Like it's like if I like for instance, yeah, if I don't want my son to learn about that stuff in school, I get like some people say, Oh, you're being homophobic, cuz yeah. But it's like I'm thinking, no, I'm not homophobic because I'm good with the English language. I'm not scared of anyone that's homosexual or mm. a lesbian. I'm not scared of you. Mm. Arachnophobia is being scared of a spider. Mm. Yeah. So I've never understood that word, mm-hmm. home homophobia. I never understood it because mm-hmm. I was so good with it's English. Not yeah, because I've never understood it. Exactly. I think, Valid point, I think, yeah, I've, I think to myself, like, them people that you call homophobic. They're not scared. They they they're filled with hatred. Mm. You know, they're mm. filled with that or whatever they've got towards that. They're it's misunderstanding. Not, it's not, yeah, they're not liking yeah, it. They're upbringing yeah, whatever, the religion. Yeah, I'm trying to say it's not. Yeah, because they have. Yeah, exactly. Because some so, those people yeah. they have they have no um, problem like going to countries that don't agree with that, like Muslim countries. You know, like some some countries that don't agree with it. You're still going like. You know, you just respect that. That's not and what you'll support their economy, you're... but be upset with their beliefs. Yeah, do you know like, what I mean? Be, this is it, and a lot of people don't stand for much, and that's why they fall for everything. But mm. like, I'll be honest with you, like what you were saying about the curriculum and sexual education in schools. Now, right, I'm a lesbian woman. Mm-hmm. Mm. My nephew, though, has never seen me lips up a woman, though, mm, mm, mm. because I'm not trying to put that in his face. I don't really want his mum and dad, not don't want them, because show affection, show love in front of him. He should know he's from a loved home, but. I'm not trying to sexualize no one out here. They're kids, woman, mm. man, two dogs. Fucking, they don't need to because they'll just naturally get inquisitive as kids. What's got? We don't need to spark that. Let's spark about being self sufficient with growing our own vegetables and what makes you happy, little man. What makes you happy, mm. little girl? And let's develop those traits and those skill sets. Mm-hmm. Why are we worrying about sex at five? Mm-hmm. What the mm-hmm. fuck? They can't even what, wash what their knees think, properly. What do you think about that Lewis Hamilton situation? Because it's like. <laughs> I remember Lewis Hamilton, I think he saw his, his little nephew or something in a ballet. ballet um, I didn't hear about that. Something right, and, he, and, what, he, and he said something about, about um, no, you shouldn't be dressed, you shouldn't be dressed, dressed as a um, girl or something, as a fairy or something. And they all got onto him, but I, I agreed think, with him. I don't think you should dress little boys as girls. But I agreed with him, but that's just my opinion. And I yeah. think that was just his opinion. I don't so think I you should I make them intentionally dress like that because I don't understand why you'd force a gender, like a, a opposite gender clothing on a child. Yeah. But if a child runs to their mum's bedroom and on a Sunday when mum's cooking and puts on their mum's lipstick because they're taking a piss, doesn't mm. mean your son's gay. No. He just thought it was funny to do that and wanted mm. a reaction out of no, you. No, box him. But no, you but still you, let you him know that that's, though, for, that's, now, that's, that's, that's I get what you're saying. Mommy. We're not trying to develop that mm. tendency of homosexuality because you want him to explore and know himself and truly find out what his mm. sexuality is at the right age. They're kids, yeah? But you boxing him now, you're looking at, that's gay. In his mind, it, that's funny. Now, remember, no, but hear me out, cousin. Yeah. No, but hear me out. 
in his mind now, I've got a box, but I, I'm not gay, bruv. Dad, are you mad? I'm chatting to five girls in school. Like, yeah. I'm looking at them. Even as a little man, I'm thinking, I want to kiss her. Yeah. yeah. And I just want to bust joke with you, Dad. And I thought I was being a mug. Yeah, mm. man. And my, now you've my, shut my, down. He knows that's not a joke for me. He knows. But anyway. Fair enough. No, but it's, but it's, it's like, remember, remember, remember the other day? Remember nephew, the other day? Though, remember the other day? Do you know what I mean? Remember the other day, yeah? Mm. And then um, <laughs> I posted, I, posted, I think, oh, yeah. Big up my sister. My sister just got Big married. Up, yeah. Aww, just got married, hey, obviously. Lovely. I had yeah, to give her away. You get me? I had to give her away and that. You get me? Because you know my man, daddy's not here. But anyway, so boom, I posted a picture with my, with Keon. Yeah. And then she's DM me, yeah? <laughs> oh, yeah. And she's, she's gone, oh, like, he's so cute. He's so beautiful. You should get him into modeling. I said he's stunning. He's, he's, mm. You should get that him into modeling, yeah? He's stunning. You should get him into modeling, cuz. I said, no, that's gay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so I had to give him a nose and Mandela yeah, Coco yeah, speech. Yeah. She's like, I'm gay. <laughs> but I knew he no, weren't but, being yeah, hateful, yeah, yeah, but yeah. I know no. he's a man who understands vocabulary and he's open-minded and he's fair. Mm. So for me, it was I was challenging him mm. now because mm. he yeah, knows I'm not coming me. from a bad place. Yeah, you know? come on. I mean, he was like, no, cuz, come on, man. I'm not, I said, yeah. but I know, but be careful. Oh, I asked him a bottle you know? like yeah. a madman. But then, oh, shit then. Yeah, I've got another one. I got another one. Come on. In the sense of what I'm saying is I don't want to be a hypocrite because I'm also for people can speak and we don't just jump on them and say that's what you meant there because you mm. actually don't know what they meant mm, mm, don't mm. what my like for me I'm a, I'll use myself as an example I can talk and use tones and people will think oh my god you meant that by that tone you were being condescending no I've actually had a headache for 48 hours and I'm just tired now mm. but I'm glad you made that assumption why not ask me what I meant if you didn't understand mm, have a bit mm. of patience what I've done with Lay messaged mm. him like Cuz mm. man, like, what do you mean, gay? Like? And then he put me straight, mm. and we mm. had that patience to get that and understand, and it was cool. Yeah, but it was funny anyway. It was. You, you, you were killing was... me. He was like, "Yeah, we're still gay." I was like, <laughs> "You're gay, go away." <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so my whole thing. Your is son that, is beautiful, by the way. Of course he is. Do you get what I'm like, trying to say? Of course he is. Yeah. No, yeah. I'm like not me. on the aesthetics fit. He looks yeah, just like I me. I think there's a bit of mummy. He has mm -mm. got you, mm. but anyway, he's a beautiful kid. But basically, yeah. What I'm saying is we got through that. It was it wasn't yes. nothing. Do you get what I'm yeah. trying to say? And it's like and that's my whole point. You should be able to have an opinion. Exactly. It's like, mm. I respect um gay people being proud proud and gay yeah, pride. I respect I've got, that. I've got um, gay pride that are gay. Like, but my whole thing is why can't we be proud? Why yeah. can't I be proud that I, that I like So gal? do you want to hear my opinion on like, this? See, like, see, how you more. like gal? I like gal. I love gal. Yeah, come on. If I was a gal, I'd probably still love gal. But can't <laughs> yeah, I be proud? Yeah, you should be able to be proud, be proud, in, proud? All, in all parts. Yeah, so can't I is, And this well. is another thing, yeah. I actually done an advert called Protect the Rainbow. Protect your rainbow. And you what it was about... light skin and dark skin. Um, well. No, it was... I'd done it with a, a group of women that had masculine features mm -hmm. yeah. that were very proud about being gay but didn't shove it down people's throats and what you have to watch the advert it's on my page what i was saying as well is i cannot stand as a gay woman you see this rainbow fucking monopolization where everyone is gay pride everything gets a rainbow slapped on it why mm. Mm. why I, I'm not I don't wear rainbows like that I'm mm, a gay woman mm, I don't mm, wear mm, rainbow I love them don't get me wrong I like the true representation of the sun and the rain and what it spiritually but for you, that's what I'm saying about you so do you see this hyped up gay thing not mm. all gay people are on that yeah, yeah, yeah. like I a heterosexual imagine. like you don't run around like I'm heterosexual like <laughs> I want you like, but, but why though like, you are what you are <laughs> no Just, but that's how I feel like I'd rather people say I'm nice <laughs> I'm approachable. <laughs> yeah. I want to uplift. I no, don't joking, fucking I'm care joking. who you're shagging. As long as it ain't yeah. kids and animals, bro. Of course. I don't do you get what I'm trying to say? I just feel like that's, people that's, say, you know saying, yeah, but you're right. Like, and you know I'm saying, I, mean? I agree to a degree. I hear yeah, what you're saying. As as it's, it's mad, bro. Because like, these companies as well, in the 80s and the 70s and then they there, where people were getting smashed up for being gay, yeah, where it weren't that, you, mm. know, you smirn off. In, that, in them days, One I can example, understand. You never that. had no rainbow on your vodka, so allow it because mm. it's cool now and you get an extra 250,000 units because I mm. will call you out because my sexuality is very serious to me. It's not a gimmick. Mm. It's not a joke. It was a journey. Mm. I took my time. Yeah, I knew you. you know? I knew you from, from before. But how, I took my time, how do you exactly? feel about people that don't agree with your sexuality though? It's, do again, you think that they should be cancelled? No, because there's a lot of people no, that have spoken out why. that don't agree. Yeah, sorry. With, so um, that's all right. But there's, um, there's a lot of people people that don't agree with it and when they've spoken out about not agreeing with it they've been cancelled okay and like at the end of the day if we say like freedom of speech and you should be able to express yourself if you don't agree with it yeah do you understand what right do you, what i'm do gonna you try and give you my opinion without being long-winded yeah. like, i can't <laughs> it's, it's so exactly it's who i am mm. I, I have i try to be clear with mm. my in my thoughts and my intentions 
For me, I don't agree with that, and I'll tell you why. My dad loves me. Mm. Yeah, my dad is a man who came to this country with nothing, made sure all his children owned houses, stayed with my mum, even though they didn't get on, but they mm. loved each other and for the sake of us, and he sacrificed. My dad never bought Clarks every month. Big up Charlie. Yeah, big up man like Charlie. Like, So my thing is this, I love my dad. My dad was present. My dad will talk real, to the park. Real Nikon, you know? Real, yeah. I was riding to Big Ben at seven on a bike with my dad behind him. All three of us. That was what my dad was on. Mm -mm -mm. Anyway, my dad told me straight, girl, Holly, listen, I love you, you know. Mm. But you see this gay thing? Mm -mm. I'm never going to understand it. Mm. I'm not going to make your partners feel awkward. I will love them as the guest in the house and as your guest, mm. but Corel, please, like... And what he was basically saying to me is, is do you, but also be mindful of me. Right. Not that I'm trying to make you feel bad for who you are, but yeah. let's meet in the middle. And that was hard for my dad. Mm. So am I going to cancel my dad? Mm. Fuck you. You either say you're gay and proud and you love this or you ain't got a daughter. Same with my mum. Mm. Co, don't get this. I really wanted kids from you. Like I'm actually heartbroken. You're my eldest daughter, but bring your partner around for dinner, man. It's cool. Mm. And, that's, and that's a real conversation. We still love each other, but we don't agree. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm, I, I respect that, man. I respect that. But freedom of speech, like, yes. it's, a, it's a wide, it's a wide um, subject. You know, when it's it, not just, it's not just about that. Because no. you know what I was, what I was when it comes to well. religion, I reckon it, it gets very, very like sticky when it comes to religion, politics, and sexuality. But you, but you have to be, you have to be mindful anyway. And it's like, to me, these days, it seems to me anyway, because it's like. <laughs> Everyone's like, make sure you don't offend yeah. people. Make sure you don't offend people. But my intentions might not be to offend. I, exactly. I don't. I'm not my. I, so I don't intend to. No one wakes up to offend. You anyone. don't. You don't intend to offend no one with your opinion. I don't intend to offend no one. With my, and you don't intend to offend no. no one. But so I think maybe today's society is today's society too easily offended. I think so. You know, like, I think so because if I was to wake up like, today and I post yeah, a picture, you know, like, if I, I, I post a picture today just, and I say, um, I'm a beautiful light skinned girl. You know, gonna happen, yeah, you're like, you know what's going to happen, innit? You're You know what's going to happen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you understand what mm -hmm. I'm saying? You're not if, asking, no? Or what do you mean, or, like, or what are you trying to what? say? Oh, you or think... Or what? Like, yeah. 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 ain't beautiful. Yeah, do you what, understand? Why, Chinese or... Yeah. yeah, do you understand what I'm saying? Like, I just feel like nowadays people need to just, like, get a grip a little bit. I just think so as well. I, I think it's... I think it's getting... Yeah, I think it's getting a bit much. Sorry, but when I looked at... The, um, I looked at the um, Freedom of Speech Act and all that. And personally, I know I'm a I love, man. I love, you're not a mad um, man. I love that. But, cuz, like, see what Wiley done? I don't feel like he broke any of them laws. Why they cancelled him like that? He just had an opinion. Mm. I think Wiley's a mad, but I know Wiley, so I know he just goes, he's, 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 you know. I he just says what he says. He's a genius. He just says what he says. He can't articulate but, himself. To me, he, d he done it. I can it, understand he it wrong. that he the offended people. I can understand yeah. that he offended a culture. Of course, of course. definitely. Of course, yeah. Do you get me? But he didn't he mean to. That wasn't his intention. No, no, no. Yeah. Definitely, yeah. but we got to sit. Like you got to understand that and when someone says something, someone. the way someone takes it, mm. you ain't got any control over that. Mm, 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 the way I receive it is the way I receive it. Mm, innit? Mm, mm. Do you get me? Especially so, when it's written. Do you understand? So the way the Jewish community received that is the way they received it. Do you get me? But with that being said, definitely not. He shouldn't be cancelled for that. Mm. But the reason he got cancelled... Why should... It, like, you're allowed to have your opinion on something. But he got cancelled because he didn't articulate himself correctly, which isn't fair. He mm -hmm. shouldn't cancel someone for that. But he got cancelled, and this is another big issue within our community. The Jewish community own their stuff. Mm -hmm. They own their platforms. They own their labels. Mm -hmm. They own the media outlets. They own bakeries. They own all the streets. Mm. What do we own? Exactly. So the minute you upset them, they're exactly. not going to come and fight you. Oh, Oh, they're going to hit you at your, in your pocket. pockets because Goodbye. that's exactly what happened. All of the platforms Simple. which he used so to make Ryan his Daly money. Link up, and it's not me attacking people now. Let's not misconstrue because people love controversy and I love peace. Mm. But why is no one building him up? But why is no one helping him? Like, again, Miley, while he's a madman. Do you know how many times I've heard that? I mm. was shocked to no, see. Mad man. I, but I was out, shocked to see the lack of people that stood no, behind him, though. Hundred percent. For, for that, you are a madman. I'm not a maniac. maniac. I'm a maniac. We're all maniacs. How, do, how can you Safe. say no, no, no? You, listen, no one knows me enough apart from my mum, dad, and family to be labelling me. <laughs> That's that. But here, what I'm saying to you is, my point is this: the realness in our community, we need to be cultivating in the sense of if someone does wrong for something silliness, what Wiley done. I'm not talking about other mm. things. I'm saying on Wiley as an example and things like this. Yeah, me personally. I would want to be saying to him, 
You need to learn to articulate yourself better. You did have valid points, but you're the godfather, but don't have godfather foundations and infrastructure. That doesn't make sense, brother. And you're supposed to be inspiring our youth. I don't want my left you looking up to you. You're not a role model, fam, because you don't own nothing but your houses. When yeah, you have had... Con Listen, sis, hear me out. Mm. Wiley's a very powerful man, sis. Definitely. Do not get all that getting your hyper and that genius energy that goes off key get you twisted. Very intelligent man. Extremely intelligent. Mm. Very powerful in this music But team. I believe yeah? that. Yeah, but what you've got to remember also but is we're like the it. first generation of us like actually breaking out to be making like money like this as well. Like, you know, like remember our grandparents came over and we're kind of learning as we go along as well. Like you don't always know no, I, every, I, everything. I, I do, you, do you know what I mean? You, I feel he, like he should have been cut a little bit of slack. And I just feel I like more... I can't cut him slack because I know him behind okay. the scenes and I know certain behaviours and I can't cut him slack because I tell you why. The music industry is one of the most lucrative industries in the world and black people are the forefront of it. But we're dancing to music that we don't own. Now, people need to start waking the fuck Definitely. up. Definitely. Real than most hashtag. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. Because what happens then is when other people start attacking us or attacking the working class, it ain't even just colour, mm. working class. We can say, no, 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 no. Hold on. I know that person's background. Mm. Yes, he did say that wrong. Dickhead. Hold mm. that for that. Mm. You need to be doing better. Hold that for that, but we're not going to cancel his whole fucking career. No, and definitely hard work. not. We're not doing that. Definitely not. But everybody, but, but a lot of, but a lot of that generation that has position. got a fight. Like you could have been much more bigger than what you are. But Spray sis, could have I been be, much more no, better. But, Do you understand what I'm saying? So no, but no. And this is why I'm sorry to cut you. And the reason I'm cutting you is because you are our age, and I mm. don't know your full age, but mm. I know you're my age. Mm. So manners and respect. Mm -hmm. But you've also come in the industry after Spray, myself, mm. right? Spray. As much as Spray's had opportunities, and I don't want to talk to you out of turn, and he'll tell me he hasn't had what Wiley's had. No. Doesn't mean he hasn't worked as hard. Mm -mm. But what I'm saying is certain people get things easier, A, because of what they're prepared to Definitely. do. Definitely. Who they know, and because of the bigger picture of these higher-ups and what they control. There's a reason certain people get pushed to the Definitely. forefront. Definitely. Because it keeps people stupid. I am not dissing Wiley. Wiley, mm. I've said this to you, bro. We've spoke. Mm -mm -mm. I've seen Wiley in Rotterdam, mm -mm -mm. Carnival. Away from, we sp I've spoke to Wiley. He knows how I feel about him. Mm -hmm. you got Wiley, man. You know, I big mm -mm -mm. him up. And that's why I'm upset with him, because mm. where's your record label? Mm. But again, I don't want to talk mm -hmm. too much. Yeah, because I've no, seen no, things and then I'm going to be talking other people's business. So all I'm saying is, is... I'm upset with him, mm. but I agree. No, he did get a harshness. But he I'm did. not going to sit here and do this whole poor, poor Wiley because no, I'm not. Sorry, mm. no. Mm. Yeah, and that's your freedom of speech. And that's my freedom of speech. Mm. And I don't want to hurt him and I don't mm. want no one to hurt him, but mm. I want him to do better, so I've got to talk the truth. Mm -hmm. What am I going to lie? I want my brother to win. Mm. He ain't going to win if I'm lying to him. Mm. And I don't want no one lying to me. Like, spray off camera and say, cuz, like, allow it, man. Or you talk too much, but cuz, that's who I am. I'm like, cool, and we work it out. Mm, mm, we're mm. real mm. sorry tangents. you know what yeah <laughs> no it's like you said <laughs> edition three I feel ah. like. sorry <laughs> cut in two <laughs> what was you gonna say spray no i just feel like time's pushing on. but you're right freedom of speech is a very diverse thing my thing is this sis people should very. be able to speak cream don't do it to hurt people and if you are going to speak you need the facts don't tell me you've got a daily mirror newspaper mm. because that's not a fact i'm talking about an author other yeah. people's accounts the history of the build-up how this happened why it didn't i want mm. everything i want the break i'm everything. surgical you see me yeah i don't do truth i do surgicals precision give me everything whether yeah. i like it or not and what then you, i'll make an informed judgment do you think Very that the um that. do you think the yeah, so basically what we're saying is that people like, we, they say freedom of speech, but people don't keep, they don't have freedom of speech. No, and but my whole, my whole thing is like... When people as, normally speak up, they normally are, are labelled as bitter and this and mm, that, and mm. they're too emotional. As soon as somebody actually mm. does come out and say what is on their mind, the first thing they say is, you shouldn't, you're going, just forget it, don't say anything, you sound bitter, you sound emotional. Mm. Just So what, what you know, like, yeah. there is no freedom of speech, there is there? There I don't know. And what people you know what? deem as freedom of speech more time is hate speech in a sense yeah. that it's come from ignorant information. Mm. And people listen to respond and to talk back. They don't listen to actually, let me take this person in and see what's mm. going mm -hmm. on. Let me and try and to, understand. Listen to both sides. Yeah. And then yeah. make an informed mm. decision. And you have to know about the person as well because... I'm deep, sis. I want to meet the person's yeah. mum and make decisions. Exactly. You I have to know deep. where the person's coming deep. from. 
to know why they feel that way. Hundreds. Do you understand? It's it's, yeah, a, it's, it's it's a load of things. Do you mm. know what I mean? I feel like I needed this chat though, man. Thank you, guys. Therapeutic. Yeah, no, no definitely yes. lovely, man. I've actually enjoyed it. <laughs> you know I'm really saying you're making it. you're making good use of your freedom of speech. I yeah, must say. <laughs> <laughs> I, must say. I love that. But, but yeah, honestly, thank no, you. but you know my whole thing, yeah, because mm. it's like we should all be entitled to our opinion. Mm -hmm. We should all be able to say what we want to say, just as long as we're able to say it articulately. And or, not hurt people. Do you get what I'm trying to say? You can have your opinion and still not yeah. want to hurt. Like, you know I've you said things to people, but not to hurt. Yeah. I want you to understand, or, just, or I want to understand. But you got, yeah, Sorry but you know there's you different first. people out here. Yeah, yeah, come Some on. Some like, that. I've always thought of myself as, I prefer the ugly truth to a beautiful lie. Mm -hmm. mm. But there's a lot of people that don't want the actual ugly. They don't mm. want the truth. They live Facts. in a, they live in that, that, mm, mm, that you mm. know, that comfortable, safety, Comfort denial bubble. Mm. And when you give them the real, that's it. They it's can't hard. take they it. Mm. Do you understand what I'm saying? That freedom of truth. speech, I don't mind. Do you get that's it? what I'm saying. Like, that freedom of speech. But that's, See me. Mm. It's the whole like, all right, cool. I feel it's how yeah. you've been brought up because my mum never sugarcoated anything mind. to me so I always knew how to take Cream. it like that. I'm just mm. saying I'm just saying this to, so the, the video don't get taken down. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> don't get Hilarious. me twisted. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Mm -hmm. Don't mm -hmm. get me twisted because mm. you know my amount already. Do you get what I'm mm. saying? Even yeah, my Twitter amounts really mad. Yeah, really the most and then they're yeah, realer than me. Twitter <laughs> amounts, my Twitter amounts mad, mad. Do you get what I'm trying I'm to say? I'm so glad I'm off Twitter, you know. Yeah, but it's like... He was off. He was off. He was off there as well. But it's like, yeah... So it's like, my whole thing is as long as you, I'm saying online and publicly and whatnot, like obviously talk how you want to talk to your people, yeah. innit? But I'm saying like, if you're like, no one should be, have their freedom of speech taken away from them because their opinion doesn't agree with yours. Mm, Do you get what I'm trying to say? That's that. my whole point. You know, we should be able to, it's like, should be able to disagree, man. Yeah, I don't you want should to be talk able to, to agree that just to disagree. Yeah, exactly. Then that that's that. Yeah, that's I don't want. Know. I don't want to talk to someone that's trying to deliberately fight me down. But I, I would, I'm happy to be mm. told things. I'm happy for learning. Give yeah, me truth, I don't like having know, conversation like, with yes men neither. Like yeah, I, don't I don't like yes when people. I'm having yeah, a conversation yeah, with that. someone and they keep saying yeah, yeah, like they just constantly agree. Like what, what do you actually think? Do you understand what I'm saying? Maybe like deluxe. Like Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you get me? Like, what do you think? 100%. Do you know what I mean? But, um, do you know what it is, Cream? Freedom of speech all day long. I'm very comfortable with not being liked as well. But so in this industry and this game, though, mm -hmm. I just believe that you have to be very careful with speech, freedom it's of speech. You have to be in the world now. The world's changed. But my thing is this as well. Because I've been on the other side of the fence of this. Mm. I'm all for freedom of speech, but please do your research and don't come to me and tell me you've read a paper because I'm not, that's not your research. Don't tell me you've read The Shade Borough and now you're informed. No, you've been entertained. Mm. You've not been informed. There's a big difference. you got difference. a pen, Dean. Yeah? Is your big hand able to give me a pen? And, and that's all I'm no, saying, I need girl. It on the camera. So and you know what else, camera. yeah? Let's that, that we need more niceness camera. out there. Like, why? For me, I don't. I don't know. I don't wake up to deliberately hurt anyone or to jump. Yeah. On, like I'm not on that. Cause, I'd rather put you're, you're just gonna keep talking. You get what I'm saying? And I'm sure I must. It must have gone past. We're on episode hour. five. Yeah, yeah, no, but Boom. it must have gone past. But, do, but when you got females, must've. you gotta know you're that. Gonna they're no, gonna no, talk. no, but yeah, yeah. yeah do you understand? Yeah, that's, that's, that's just. That's just Am I getting a CD? And that, yeah? No, not you, not you. But this what is this is the winner. The winner. The winner of the last episode, isn't it? Yeah, open up with your big hand, Carl. Your big hand can definitely <laughs> open that. Your big hand can definitely open that. You've got bare hand. Why don't you put those in a, in a cup? Make Why? It oh. It's cool here. I thought that was for me, you know. I was legit sitting up, like, nah, getting nah. ready to say. All right, so this is this is what my, my raffle, what I've been doing. Obviously, my j last thing. Fun to pick one. This is, this is, yeah, I want you to pick yeah, one. Yeah, come on. Yeah. The I guest has last, to do The last it. bag I used was, was the uh, meat and chips bag. <laughs> I think this bag is this bag. Up, I think I bought some washing powder or something. Oh else. gosh! But yeah, jail last thing. Look, there are people this time. Let it's me take heavy. one then. Come, man. Yeah, you shuffle. Man, you move it. Two bounce have done it so quick. I'm trying to take time with this. You get me? And two big one is taking long to open it. Do you mean to try and open it, Dean? I want this one. <laughs> You're right over there. <laughs> King visualizations. At, at King, King Visualizations. Visualizations. Big up you, at King Visualizations. Well, like, no, no. Visualizations. Oh, so you, you have won. Oh, yeah, the answer was Tottenham Riot. Yeah, some of you lot 
put the answer was R.I.P. Mark Duggan, R.I.P. my brother, but I got it, so I, I made you lot win as well. Okay. So yeah, Cream told me I should sign it, so that's why I open yeah, it for you. Yeah, personalize it. I think yeah, would be better. Don't you think so? Like I think a sign. I think a sign would be better. That's why I open it for you, King. Visualization. Like I know check you don't. One, two, Thank you. Hey. <laughs> now that's but nice. Yeah. That you, that, is he gonna see that then? Because that's a black barrel on a black team. Yeah, he's cool, man. He's all right, man. I got you a shirt. Thank you very much. Uh, Appreciate that. Thanks Royal for coming, Blue. Thanks for coming on and keeping oh, it real. Yeah. What chocolate as well? No, no, not for you. This ain't for you. This is for ice How cream. Are you pulling out gifts and telling me that this I'm for ice for cream. You. My co-host because <laughs> she's helped me. She's Come the one on. that made me start this podcast. Ice cream. You don't get to open it yet. <laughs> thank you. you oh, thank you, cuz. Thanks. Um, yeah, we got this for the new competition. Let me see. Where you need to have a big head, though. I, I, find, I find it from the from the old from the older. <laughs> yeah, Deluxe, you couldn't enter this still. This can definitely fit Deluxe's head. <laughs> nah, can, you can see it's large. Fam, <laughs> it's large. I got a small small island head. I'm I don't know. See what I'm saying? <laughs> Sinking on my head. Sinking. But yeah. Good vibes, man. If you got a small head, just have it and just it's a collector's item, isn't it? But yeah, yeah. boom. Standard. Good so vibes, I wanna man. know. Looking after the people then. Yeah, definitely. What is track number seven on Relay the Most Volume 2? What's track number seven on Relay the Most Volume 2? So enter that if you've got a big head. You and don't saying? put if the you, answers in the head, comments. Tell them not to put the answers in the comments. If, yeah, I know you lot keep putting How the answers the DM, in the yeah? comment. Yeah, yeah mad. you've got to DM. DM yeah, 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 with follow the answer. At RTM Podcast Show and at RTM Clothing Original and DM the answer to that. Yeah, cool, and then man. you and then you won't win that. And obviously, can't forget the book. You know I ain't forgot the book. Mm. Like every episode I give them a book to go and read. Good vibes, good life. Yeah, this one's by Vex King. He's actually on Instagram. You can follow him at Vex King. Mm-hmm. It's called Good Vibes, Good Life. It's a bit of fluff. It's annoying. How self love is the key to unlocking your greatness. Vex mm. King, yeah. Yeah, it's actually <laughs> I like it's a good, that it's a good, <laughs> good book. Be the best version of you that you can be. This is the synopsis. This ain't praise. Yeah? <laughs> this ain't praise. How can you learn to truly love yourself? How can you transform negative emotions into positive ones? Is it possible to find lasting happiness? In this book, Instagram guru <coughs> Vex King answers all of the questions and more. Vex overcame adversity to become a source of hope for thousands of young people and now draws from his personal experience and his intuitive wisdom to inspire you to practice self-care, overcome toxic energy mm-hmm. and prioritize your well-being. Cultivate po- positive lifestyle habits, including mindfulness and meditation. Change your beliefs to invite great opportunities into your life. Manifest your goals using tried and tested techniques. Overcome fear and flow with the universe. Find your higher purpose and become a shining light for others. In this book, Vex will show you that when you change the way you think, feel, speak and act, you begin to change the world. Mm. But yeah. Amen. I like that. that. Yeah, that sounds good. I ain't even finished reading it. but um, You started it, yeah? Yeah. But I know the fifth fifth chapter was, was good. Seeing some good chapter names though, like irrelevant, like resonate, so you can mm. see well, it's insightful it, yeah. with the mm-hmm. right stuff. Yeah, mm-hmm. like one said, take time out, and then the other one said about being authentic self or something. Mm. I don't know. I was in book. the bookshop earlier on. I went and bought uh, my son and my daughter a new book. Um, I love two days shopping. ago. I'm never gonna lie. I never thought like, I would. Yeah, part of their Christmas presents. Yeah, yeah. I'm like me it. and my partner, we bought a book that we thought would be suited for them. You know, like just like an yeah. inspirational book. Part I mean? five: manifesting yeah. goals, mind work. Come on. This is just to start a part five. Whatever the mind of man can conceive and believe, it can achieve. When trying to manifest your goals, it's important to keep a high vibration. Feelings are returned on a like-for-like like basis. 
So it's crucial for you to master everything you've learned in the previous sections of this book. But well, obviously you've got to read the previous section. However, without doubt, your beliefs are fundamental when it comes to manif manifestation. If you don't believe in something, you rarely see it in your life. So let's spend some time exploring the importance of our beliefs and how they affect our reality. Basically, it starts in there, you know. Got to believe. 100%. Got to believe. Definitely. But yeah, check this, check this Definitely. book out. You think it, you achieve it, right? Yeah. It's a good book. Let's think the right things. Yeah. People do better and do good, no. man. Yeah. But yeah, thanks for rocking with me. Rocking with us. I yeah. Thank you guys, man. Today. Thank you for everyone like, supporting. You know, and thanks for all the support, like Cream said. You know, big up everyone. Big up Audio Saviors. Definitely big up you know, Audio Saviors. see you lot. Big you up lot Audio always, Saviors. Yes. Always supporting. So, um, yeah. You know, and um, I just want to just say, just before the end of this, um, be mindful in the comments because obviously I know you lot are going to go you lot might go mad. So if it's too any hate or anything in that, I'm going to delete it. And I don't normally delete comments. That's why the comment saying spray just is mad. is still there. Mm. You dickhead, so does your mama. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Spray just mm -hmm. is mad. So and I'm, and one about me get rid well. of the what's. I got rid of it though, still. <laughs> and, I, and I'd like to say I'm open to people with their feedback and their comments. However, yeah. if it ain't constructive and you're not genuinely trying to understand something, I, I don't, keep I don't it to care. Yourself. Not even keep it to yourself. I don't care. It won't yeah, reach me. me. Yeah. Like live your life. Yeah. But yeah, Big up everyone. Good vibes. Follow the enjoy queen. Your Christmas and everything. Come on. Cream. Nice cream. Ice cream. The poster girl. Hey. Follow. Coel underscore Lady Fury. And look out for Channel Yoon. Can I just say, cuz, any up and coming artists out there that are looking for a platform that's going to work with you, support you, help mm. you understand contracts, teach mm -hmm. you how to network, as well as just take your upload money, mm -hmm. hit us up, man. Seriously, because we've got a lot of good work going on. We've got a good team. Good. And good, I just want good. people to know my angle. Yeah. I'm just here to help people understand give knowledge and support people in doing the right thing that's yeah. what i'm on anything else you, miss me that's good peace you, man. i hope that's not sure. a gang sign i'm just that's felt right yeah too free <laughs> live your life